Hello everyone, Miss Art Garden here, and today we're going to do a Let's Draw of Alexia. She's a character from, uh, she's a character requested by Fernando Yanmar, and let's go ahead and get started. She's supposed to be kind of a tough girl, so I'm going to pick another color than black for my sketch layer. So we're going to draw her kind of, you know, looking tough. Let's make sure it's a color that can actually be seen on camera. There we go, that'll be better. So I'm going to draw, you know, um, I think kind of a forward-facing tough tough girl look so we'll just go ahead and start with the the cranium circle and the guides for the center of the face and the horizontal part of the face and we'll just sort of sketch in the general you know face shape and if you're really lazy you can highlight this uh, copy paste transform put it up there except it doesn't quite match up there we go and then merge your layer, but I don't always do that, but I thought I'd show you that little trick if you want them to be really symmetrical right off the bat. Now we have some very symmetrical cheeks, but I'll probably make adjustments anyways, but you know, let's not actually have uh, her facing totally full. Well, we'll do it for now and we might, we might change it later, but to make it easier to see the symmetry of her face, we'll leave it like this and then, and then change it later. So let's draw in the bottom of her eyes just like so and um, now that I got them as reference at the center of her face I'm going to draw in her nose and we'll just draw kind of draw in the bottom of her nostrils to start with and just kind of make them how you want and you can do like a little little bump to show the bump of the nose and the nostrils if you want and something like that and that might be a little bit too squished looking so I'm just gonna select it warp it make an adjustment and you can just erase this and redraw it how you want it or you can just manipulate it however your style of drawing is so I'm also gonna move it down a bit so I think it's too high up okay perfect now we have that and we'll draw in her lips or her mouth or so um, like I said she's supposed to be kind of a tough girl so we'll give her kind of a pout and uh, draw the bottom in just like that and the top in well there we go just sketching in the top the uh, the general look for now and we can go back in and make adjustments and corrections later so there we go I'm gonna move this uh, I'm gonna shrink it a bit and then move us up even though I just moved it down just keep making the adjustments until you feel happy with them, I think. Okay, so we'll draw in the eye shape here and here. Erase some of these guys now that they're not really needed as much anymore. I'm going to move... If you want your eyes to be super symmetrical, you can do the same thing I did with the side of her face at the beginning. But I, don't, I think I've drawn them close enough that it's okay. You don't want it to look too... I don't want it to look too, like, mirrored. Although I think there's a time and a place for that too. So, you know, just kind of sketch in some details, eyelashes, just like so. And um, I'm going to erase some of these. Let's draw in the, you know, like little crease above her eyelid, just like that and that. Her eyebrows. Let's give her kind of a scally eyebrow. Let's start a little bit lower like this and goes up over here. Like I remember the eyebrows for once. Give a little crease wrinkle there. And this one, uh, we won't go so far uh, down. I'll just kind of go like that. And those might be a little thick. And the reference, she has kind of arched eyebrows. So arch this one up a bit. There we go. And we'll give her some pupils. Since I always wait till the last minute to get drawn the actual eyes for some reason. And then a little detail of the corner of the eye I like to draw in. There we go. So now we have that. Um, I guess we could draw in like a little side of the nose there. And let's start now. Um, I'm going to change this now. To turn it to the side a bit. And, you know, give her kind of a, a let's just kind of make her so like one shoulder over here and the other one's kind of this one over here 
And this can go down like she's, you know, got a little bit of a tilt to her her body language here. That's just barely seen. And let's see. This shoulder should probably come out a little bit more. Just make that adjustment there. And now that we have that in, let's draw her hair in. So I'm erase some of this line here. And we're gonna, let's draw her ears in actually before we draw her hair. So starting about at the top of her, you know, eye here, we'll draw the ear in. And it ends right about the bottom of the nose. Same over here. Look, get the shape right. And she's got these big hoop earrings. So we can go ahead and sketch those in as well. Just like that. And. Ooh, I'm being very sloppy today. I'm getting used to a new Photoshop program. <laughs> so it all takes a little bit of work. Get used to new things. Okay, that's that's good. I might work on those this earrings particularly later. Just kind of think it needs to be fixed up a little bit in shape. Okay, now let's draw her hair in. And I was thinking of having it um, make some loose strands. She's got it parted to one side. I think I'll give her kind of goes like that and then this goes these styles go back these little strands I mean and then she has some here just like that and then we can just kind of sketch in the rest she's got some like loose flowing hair like that and that this goes up like I said and like this So when he, when uh, Fernando requested the um, characters, he gave me like a choice of two that he wanted me to pick from. I decided to go with Alexa because the other one was always smoking. And I lost both my grandparents pretty much to smoking. So <laughs> I thought I just didn't really want to want to do a character that smoked. I guess that's kind of a personal choice. But she, Alexa was, I think the other one was named Barbara. Alexa was... Um, you know, she had uh, red hair. <laughs> I like red hair. I think it's fun to draw. So we just kind of sketch in. She's got kind of a, a yellow top here that I'm I'm making a little little bit of little bit of reference to, and um, I think that's pretty good. Just like that. And we'll just kind of finish drawing in her hair and we will be done. So I'm actually going to erase this eye a little bit. <laughs> that hair. Do I like it that far down? No, I don't think I do. So before I erase that eye, I'm actually just going to move this hair up a little bit. I think it'd be better just to have it, you know, I think it's, it's good if it either covers the eye completely or just covers it a little bit. It looks kind of weird if you cover it halfway, in my opinion. So we'll just kind of sketch in this loose hair here and here. And, um... I realize I've erased part of her expression there. I think it still comes off okay. I mean, we can erase it. We can go back. We have a history, so we'll go up here. Yeah, I guess this just erase it like this here. So she had this eyebrow and she had the crease and we'll have this kind of go down but not like all the way over like so and like so. This is a very big mess. <laughs> we'll just keep working on it until we don't think it's so messy. There and there. There we go. Now I'm going to erase this line. Now and we'll bring this out just like that. We could just have this actually sew through. Sometimes I do that. Okay, so now we have her sketched out. I'm going to just change her hairline real quick and then I will show you the final image. Okay. So there she is, 
let's see the final image in three, two, one, there. So there is Alexa. If you guys have a character that you want me to draw for the next Let's Draw, um, it could be, you know, your own character or a fan art of something, whatever you want, just leave it in the comment section below. And I hope you guys have a great day and I will see you in the next video.